Hey guys, it's Rachel from Three Sisters Toy Style, and today I'm going to be showing y'all makeup tutorials that y for going out places. So I'll tell y'all the first tutorial. So if y'all guys want don't know what look you should do for a date or whatever, here's one. So you will need Love Struck eyeshadow, and you'll need two colors of blush. Y'all can use the dark or light. I just use both at the same time. You could use some sparkly pink or regular pink lip gloss. I'm going to use both and mix it. If you're going to mix it, use a mixing brush. Pick out a makeup brush. This is actually supposed to be for eyeshadow, but I use it as a lipstick blender because I have like so much eye thingy. You'll need a blush brush and mascara. Y'all guys might use foundation, but I don't know how to use foundation yet, so I'm just showing y'all what I would do. Even though I'll probably not be going on a date till like I'm 20. But, let's watch. Oh yeah, and don't forget your eye brush, you know, yeah. So now let's get started. So the colors I'm going to use... Is where's is that? I'm gonna use this dark pink right here with this sparkly pink right here. So let's watch. And you'll probably need a little brush to do the creases. So I'm gonna start with the dark pink. So yeah. So you just want to do it lightly on this eye because if you have really dark pink eyes, somebody's probably going to think you have the something wrong with your eyeballs. Alright, and then you do the same to the other one. And then that's good. So I like to do this so I can get some of it up there. I just, yeah. So after you're done with that one, you take the smaller one and you go to the sparkly pink one. And then you go on the creases. I'll show you in a minute. So you do the creases up here only. And then make sure you blend it in good. Like do this. Like pull it down a little bit. And then you'll have a little sparkly top like that. And then you do the same to the other eye. And now it looks like this. So now we're moving on to the mascara, and everybody knows how to put mascara on. And if you're younger and you don't know, I'll show you. So for the younger people that don't know how to use mascara, so you take it out. This end has so much mascara on it, like this end right here. So you take it at the edge and you wipe it off like that so that you don't get any in your eyeballs. And now you leave it like that. There is already mascara on the brushes, so you don't got to keep dipping it in, dipping it in. Like, why isn't it up there? Why isn't it up there? Because it's already up here. So, next you, um, go close up to your eyeball. And younger people don't need to do their eyelashes down here. I do because I'm older and I know how to do it. But, you do this. You take your eyelash like that, and you do that. And if you blink your eyes, then this is a way you could do it if you don't want to open your eye. You could take your eyelash, put it at the end of this, and blink. Like that. Like that. And then you do it to your other eye. So that's what it looks like. It makes your eyelashes longer and darker. So, I'm going to do mine at the bottom because, just for the tutorial. Alright, so this is what it looks like. I did mine at the bottoms too. Yeah. So, next, you use the blush. So, you have to use a really big blush. Unless you're a little kid, you're trying to put it on a little kid, then you need a smaller brush because their cheeks are probably not this big. Mine aren't either. It's literally as big as my cheek, literally. But I'm going to use it because it's big and I like big brushes. So, I'm using both of them. I just take it like this and just do that. Then you do this for the little kids that don't know where their cheekbone is if you're putting makeup on. You do your cheeks like this. 
like that. And then you do it on this part. Like that. And you take it to your ear. Me, I can just do this now. Because I know where it is. I've done makeup for a little bit now. So you do that. And then you do it to the same. And y'all guys that like to do that with your face, I know which one you use that one for. You use it with the, um... If I could find it, it's highlight contour. Yeah, you can do this all over your face with just the contour one. If you do it with the pink one, then your face will look pink. So just do this part. This is fun. Alright, next, you use. The sparkly and the dark pink one. So you take the. I'll show you what you do with the light pink one. So you trace the um, outline of your lip with this, like that. And then you take the dark, pink, sparkly pink one, and I'll show you what you do with that one. You do that with the rest of your lip. So after that, you mix it with this. So, yeah. So when you're done mixing it, you're probably going to say, Hey, there's already lipstick glitter all over my lips. Well, that's because you have glitter on one lipstick and you're mixing it. But it looks cool because one glitter, ha one has glitter with dark and one, and then it gets darker and then lighter and lighter as you go down. So that's my tutorial for this one. And you'll probably want to put your hair up like this. So you can just put it up in a bun. I'm very terrible at doing my hair, so if it looks bad, I'm sorry. But you can put it up in like a messy bun. It doesn't really matter. And you could get some good looking earrings on. And then you're done. I'm actually really actually surprised that I actually put this in like what in the world oh my dreams always get ruined look at my hair now I mean it I cannot do my freaking hair like I can't do my hair don't just ugh. my hair is poofy Hey guys, I'm back. So, I'm Rachel from Three Sisters Toy Staff. So, today I'm going to be doing a another makeup tutorial. So, this is the Mermaid makeup tutorial. So, I'm going to use the Color Wave Bronzer Blush Brush Mascara and the, a light pink lipstick. So, I'm going to teach y'all guys how to do that. And I keep always, I always forget this one important, really, really important brush that I'm probably going to need is this one. So, let's get started. So, the two colors I'm going to use is that one and that one. Um, I'm going to use that one and that one. So, let's get started. So, oh yeah, and I'm going to need this brush too. So, I do the light, lighter one on this part. So, I'll show y'all that. So, you'll probably need two shades of that one because it really doesn't show. But, there's the light one. And, I do this. And then, next thing you will need is a brush that looks like this. And, you will take the darker one. And by the way, one's light blue and one's turquoise that I'm using. Just sounds mermaidy color to me. So then you do the crease. 
you do it up here, the darker part up here, and then you do it with the other eye. So there's this one. You do it at the top crease. And yeah, that's the eyeshadow. So next you will need the mascara. For this mermaidy one, I'm gonna do the top and the bottom. So here's this one. So there's that one. Next I'm gonna use is the bronzer. So you take that out of the, the you take the cap off of it first. How, how do you get this off? How do you get this thing off? This thing has to come off. Oh, there we go. Alright, anyways. Now, you take this part. This part right here. Do that part, little kids, if you have makeup. Like that. And me, I just don't have to do that anymore because I could just do this. I've actually never used bronzer before. <sighs> I like doing that for some reason. Alright, so I'm going to look in the mirror to see what it looks like. And it looks good, so here you go. Gets darker a little bit. Can't really notice it. Now we're gonna use this one. So you take it out, and you just color your whole lips with it. Basically, everybody knows how to do that. Wait, not everybody. For some reason, I looked at makeup fails because I do that all the time because it looks really funny sometimes. And girls, you only go do this line like this because you don't just do that with your lipstick. I saw it. You don't. You don't do that. I understand if it's a little kid, but if you're older, you need to know that if you go to school with this, it's not big lips. This is your lips. This is your skin part, not lips. You, you just don't color over it. Because then if you think big lips, lips don't go all the way up to your nose. Because eventually you'll be able to touch your lips with your nose like that, and that would be weird. So just do this with your lips, like this. Like that. Like that. So, yeah, that's what you do. And it looks like that. Alright, there we go. Now it looks like this. Alright. And y'all guys comment down below happy birthday to Lee because his birthday is on Friday. So here's the, my final looks. And with your hair, you could put it like this. Like this. So, as uh, you can tell, I'm very terrible at my hair, so up here didn't really braid, but you know what? I don't care. And I have little heart earrings that look like mermaid colors, so I'm going to keep them. Oh, my hair is so poofy. So hey guys, um, I'm back again with another tutorial, so I'm Rachel from Three Sisters Toy Style, so this last tutorial is going to be one that you could do at school, I, I think I've showed you this one in another makeup tutorial, this one will show better, so this is, it's called eyeshadow, literally, so you'll need that, this with this, you will need these two. And you'll need some sparkly lip gloss.
So let's get started. So the colors I'm going to use on this one is this one, this one, this one, and this one. So with this color right here, you're going to put it on this, this whole part. So I put it on this whole part of my eye. So next I'm going to use the brown with these. So you do the brown on the creases and then you add just a tiny bit of black. If you add too much, then it won't turn out great. So just add about that much, not even a lot. And then you put it on the crease of your eyes. So I added some black, but don't add too much because then it won't look right. So then the last part of your eye is to add some white to this this part and then you go up and add it with that. You do this and then you do that so that when it, it's cool because it gets darker and then lighter and lighter as you go over here which you can't see it over there. So that is that one and then you do it again with the other eye. Make sure you use the same side, like you use this side, like you did on this side. Like that. So that's the end of that. The final look is that. So next, you do your mascara, because you'll need that. And put it on your eyes. So you put it on like this, and after that, you take your blush, you open it, and then I'm using both, like this, and then like that. like this and then when you're done you put the sparkly lipstick on on your whole lip So that is the end of this one. So final looks look like that. So if comment down below which one did you like the best, and if you didn't like any of them, then you can comment down that below too. And please like and please subscribe and please comment down below if you've used any of them before or if you're going to use one of my ideas to go somewhere. And also. If you're a tomboy and you don't know how to do your makeup, if you want to do makeup without, you know, it looking too girly, or if you like makeup but you don't want it to look too girly, you could just use mascara, some regular um, foundation, light foundation, some maybe clear lip gloss, and some coloring brown eyebrows or whatever, and that won't look too girly. And also, if you are a little kid and you don't you don't aren't supposed to use mascara and you have a little you can just put water on your finger and do that or you could just pretend it's mascara honestly it'll kind of look like it i mean probably won't stay but you know yeah so please like please subscribe and please comment down below which one you like and please comment down below a happy birthday to lee because his birthday's on friday so please like please subscribe and bye